Sup, guys? <clears throat> Let me try that again. It's pretty early. Next minute. Sup, guys? How we doing? Welcome back to another Rugby Player Reacts video. Another episode of Rugby Player Reacts to the NFL's Top 100 Players of 2021. Today, we're focusing on number 85. His name's Zach Martin. He's a Dallas Cowboy. He's a big man. He's been on this list before, and he'll most likely be on it again. But before we get into that video, a quick word from our exclusive video sponsor, Redcon1. What's going on guys? It's me again. First and foremost, thank you for clicking on this video. Secondly, this video is proudly brought to you by Redcon1. Now for anyone who's been around this YouTube channel for any length of time, you may know, or you may not, that the reason I begun this channel was to do with bodybuilding and fitness. In fact, I've always had a passion for bodybuilding and fitness, and I still do. So it made sense to finally connect with a worldwide trusted supplement brand. And the one that I've chosen for this YouTube channel is Redcon1. Now personally, I've been using Redcon1 products for a good five years. The first product I ever used was Total War. It's a pre-workout. I don't use pre-workouts all the time, but if I do, you can bet your bottom dollar I'm going straight for that Total War. You know, Redcon1 as a brand is going from strength to strength. Head over to their website and check out their entire range of products. It's not just Total War and it's certainly not just supplements. They've got everything. So, whether you are from the United States, whether you're from Canada, or whether you're from the UK and Europe, you have an opportunity to head down into the description box below, check out the website link for whichever of the three regions you're in, use code T20JMC. So that's T20JMC for 20% off your order. And look, whether it's a t-shirt, a snapback, or a tub of Total War, I can guarantee you're gonna be happy. Once again, this video is brought to you exclusively by Redcon1. Myself and my YouTube channel are proud to be partnered with Redcon1. Head down into the description box below, check out all of the information, and uh, well, happy lifting, guys. And peace out. Right, guys, uh, now that that's over, let's get into the video. Are we focusing on the fullback or the guard? Oh, there's Martin. I thought they were highlighting number 86. But no, number 70. There he is. Paving the way. Paving the way for not only his fullback, but also his halfback coming in behind. It's almost as if they've got three fullbacks on the field. people on Sundays. Yeah. Zach, Zach's that guy. Demolishes people on Sundays. Well, believe it or not, guys, it might be Monday here, but in a certain part of the world, it is Sunday. Holding. Offense. Number seven. seven, seven, seven. Surely not. Behold, you are about to see Cowboys guard Zach Martin commit a penalty. Don't blink. You'll see him restrict Eagles defensive tackle Fletcher Cox in violation of Rule 12, Section 1, Article 3 on offensive holding. Just as we started to get any scrambling. I don't know about that. That's a bit harsh. Out of Danucci, Zach Martin didn't really know where his quarterback was and grabbed the jersey. And... That's got to be one of the most pathetic offensive fouls I've ever seen in my entire life. In fact, in fact, for Fletcher Cox to have accepted that. No. That was that. Thus ends the Zach Martin penalty montage for the 2020 season. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, that's what they were getting at. Doesn't happen often. Martin's one-time flagrant disregard for the rules brings his penalty total to six. In the last five seasons combined. You have got to be kidding me. This guy is a guard. A very important position. A position that you fade mentally just for a split second. You get beaten by your opposite man just just, just the wrong way. And a penalty is extremely easy to give. Six penalties in five seasons. You want this guy on your line. Bind. When you watch Zach... He's just very sound and, and very technical in his work. For a long time, Zach Martin has been one of the best players in the NFL, regardless of position. 
he was always the reliable one on that line. The inside zone runs, the runs between the tackles are really what he wants to feature. And why is that? Because that's where Zach Martin is. You gotta run the rock. Yeah. Just Makes sense. It's our bread and butter rock, you yeah. know. He's able to pass off blocks. <laughs> well, that was almost like a, a rugby pass, either to the right or left. That time he spiraled him to the right. Uh, you know, uh, be a good run blocker. This is one thing I do remember, actually, very vividly. Zach Marson, number 70 for the Cowboys, loves running downfield. He's got pace. In fact, I believe he runs a 40-yard dash in less than five seconds. on the edge that's well it wasn't quite running downfield but uh crossfield huge play right there grady jarrett's gonna go across zach martin you see the patience right there he's able to actually get in behind that block that's a dynamic block if i ever did see it martin wasn't as consistently dominated not to be confused with a shoulder block a right guard as in seasons past that's usually done by an offensive player because Cowboys injuries forced him at times to excel instead at right tackle. Going from guard to tackle, uh, not having any work at it, uh, no thanks. First time I've ever heard someone talk about transitioning from guard to tackle and you know to hear someone like Cameron Hay would say no, no thanks. It mustn't be that easy. Sometimes. Can't be as easy as it looks, put it that way. He did both in the same game. <laughs> they moved Zach Bart out to right tackle. Look at that. Tell you what, it'd be nice to be a Dallas Cowboys running back. When you have a combination like he has that is able to be a guard center tackle if they needed it, he's pretty special in that approach. I think it's his first year when he came out. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, uh, that's that's a that is a face I'll never forget. Zadarius Smith, one of the nicest guys you'll ever see on this list. But this video is not about Zadarius Smith, and it's not about the next guy on the list, Leonard Williams. It's about Zach Martin. And with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. First video of the day, number eighty-five. We are officially, I'm going to say, one sixth. Let's call it one sixth through the list. And that, my friends, is a success. So, guys, if you have enjoyed the video, if you're enjoying the series, hit that like button, subscribe for more, check out Redcon One for all of your supplement needs. The links are in the description box below. It's been an absolute pleasure, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out, guys.